Good afternoon, everybody. Hope you guys are all doing well on this Saturday. It's a beautiful day here in Southern California. Sitting here in the parking lot at work, <clears throat> I had a package delivered uh, two days early. So I'm happy about that. So I made the trek out here to work from home. Um, prior to being home, uh, we were at uh, the South Coast Plaza in Costa Mesa, California, where there's a tinderbox. And I believe I mentioned it in a, in a previous video. Um, so this place carries, you know, tobaccos, they carry pipes, they carry cigars, uh, men's accessories and, and pipe accessories and things like that. Um, so today when I went, I thought, you know what, let's grab a few tins of tobacco. So being that they only had one left, I picked up a, a Best Brown Flake number no. two. And this stuff is incredible. Great stuff. Really good stuff. It's Burley in Virginia. Tasty. So I picked up one tin to go with my brown sugar flake that I'm awaiting. And uh, they had quite a bit of uh, capstan blue, so I picked up three tins of that. Summer's coming, guys. Gotta, gotta be sure you have uh, some capstan. Virginias are very nice in the summer. Also picked up some butane and this uh, Calibri. This is by far, for me, the best butane out there. Love it. And uh, as I was talking to the guy, the uh, associate there, uh, I was looking at the, at the pipes behind him, because uh, they carry them on the wall. They have Savinelli's, they have Peterson's, they have Mastro Geppetto, they have the Mallard uh, pipes. The, I don't know if you guys have seen the Mallard pipes with the little Mallard head on the, on the uh, I think it is on the stem. I don't think it, yeah, it's on the stem. It's not on, it's not on the actual shank of, of the stomach. Um, Really nice pipes, by the way. Kind of pricey. And uh, I think they carry some Moretti's as well. But I was looking under the... <laughs> I was looking under the Wessex brand. And um, they had a pipe that was very uh, similar to the 673. The shape. And this is my favorite shape. If you guys you know, have been watching my videos, you guys know that the 673 is my favorite shape. And so I picked up this little guy. Pretty much the same shape right <laughs> so I figured hey why not so when I saw it I asked him I said you know asked him if I could look at it and um, I'm not one for the swirly stems but this one reminds me of uh, that first drop of creamer in coffee and some black Colombian coffee and it just it looks like that before it gets homogenous and just blends together I mean, that's just, I don't know, to me, that's just beautiful. And it really, it really has a nice contrast to the stain on the stumble. And this is a great pipe. It's a Wessex made in Italy. I know, when, when I think of Essex, I mean Wessex, not Essex. When I think of Wessex, I think of uh, the UK. <laughs> really, I do. But um, I looked at it, I inspected it in front of them, and looked for any pits, anything that might be, you know, in the briar. I don't see any fills. I don't see anything that would have deterred me from purchasing this pipe. It's also non-filtered, which I love it. That's, to me, no filter is better. Um, I know some people, they use filter for, uh, you know, tongue bite purposes and all that. But uh, I don't usually get tongue bite. And if I do, it's because I'm just steaming too hard <laughs> so um i asked him i'm like how much is that pipe and he says believe it or not 45 dollars." i was like throw it in the bag dude i don't i don't care <laughs> just throw it in the bag i'll buy it so i got this guy this guy is a beautiful beautiful thing got some cross grain on that rim there i like how it's kind of it's a little beveled, the rim. I love that. I love that. And it's pre-carbonized, and um, it's about maybe a little over, I think it's a little over an inch and a half in there, which is good. I, I love deep pipes. That's, that's for me. So I'm going to open up this box that I received today in the mail and show you what I got. And uh, just full disclosure, it's, it's not a pipe. Not yet. I do have one coming. And I'll open up that box as well once I receive it. So the box says, Fragile Handle of Care. Winchester. 
Oh man, I need to clean that blade, don't I? I need to sharpen it too. It's getting very dull. You shouldn't have to put too much pressure to cut something with a knife. That's how accidents happen, right guys? Oh boy, here we go. Paper. This stuff. So first, picked up some shandy gaff. I don't know if you guys ever had this stuff. It's burly. It's burly and I think it has some oriental in it. I forgot. It's been a couple of years since I've had this. But um, but I picked up some shandy gaff because uh, though summer's coming, so is fall, right? <laughs> Let's see. Oh, and I got, looks like I got some tins of tobacco. I forgot I got these. Of course. My Peterson Deluxe Navy Rolls. Love these guys. And some more Peterson Flake. 2022. December 2022. And the uh, Navy Rolls are also December 2022. So this is what I was really looking forward to picking up. It is a Neil Yarm three pipe stand. Mmm, smells good. So, like I said, I have a couple of pipes coming, and wow, look at that. Look at that. These uh, stands are generally sold out on smoking pipes, but uh, I saw that they had one, and I was like, Psh, I'm getting it. It matches my other stands that I have my pipes on, so. Yes, sir. One of these days I'll do a, uh, a show and tell of my, my collection. My pipe collection. And uh, just so you know, the majority of them are, of course, Peterson and Savinelli's. And specifically, Savinelli 673's. I have quite the collection. So that's it guys, that's my haul for today. Um, I also noticed uh, from uh, from Doug, uh, Trucking Piper, he went to the Country Squire and he picked up some tins and um, some butane as well, as a matter of fact. <laughs> so that's pretty cool, it was good to see you buddy. Good to see you Doug. Today I'm smoking some Escudo out of my 673 Sienna 9mm drill. And if you guys don't know by now, um, I know this is a straight grain, but uh, Bird's Eye is my absolute favorite. And there is some underneath. <clears throat> so yeah guys, that's it. That's all for today. And uh pray you guys are all blessed and feeling well, healthy. Hope you guys had a good meal today. Hope you guys are feeling the, the love of the Lord as He blesses you with uh, everything you need. And um, I don't know, I'll catch you guys soon. And uh, maybe maybe on the next one, no, nah, it won't be too soon. I was going to say maybe on the next one it'll be another box opening, but no, that's not till maybe, maybe, you know what, maybe Monday. Maybe Monday. I think something is, something else is supposed to be delivered Monday, but we'll see. And you'll know. All right, guys, have a great night. And I pray you have a blessed Sunday tomorrow. If you need any prayer, let me know. I got you. Uh, I pray for you guys anyway. Um, it's funny you can ask my wife because when we pray at uh, dinner time or any meal, I do mention uh, a lot of you guys in my prayers. So, um, and one guy I'm uh, haven't seen in a while is uh, Yusuf from South uh, South Africa. So, buddy, if you're watching, I pray that you're doing okay. I pray that everything's well where, where you are. And um, I don't know. Let us know. Drop us some comments. God bless you guys. Have a good night. And remember, keep it lit.